Hey everyone, hope you all are doing well. This is Preeti Ghosh and welcome to my YouTube channel, which is all about lifestyle and education. So, if you are looking for a channel where you can get different aspects of lifestyle and yes, at the same time, get access to wide range of books and educational videos, so you are subscribing to the right channel. So, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. We are going to discuss the exercise questions of chapter 1 that is green plants producers of food. So the first question is the leaf is attached to the stem by. Leaf jo hai wo stem se attached hota hai. Kis part se? The answer is stalk. The next question is. Water and carbon dioxide enters the leaf through the answer is stomata. Question number 3 says the food prepared by the plant in the form of answer is starch. It is prepared in the form of starch. Question number 4 which of the following is not needed in photosynthesis? In me se konsa photosynthesis ke liye zaruri nahi hai? The answer is oxygen. Question number 5. The energy that we get from the food produced by plant is the energy of. Jo energy hume food, jo plants prepare karte hai, wo khane se milti hai, wo actually kis cheese ke energy hoti hai? Is the energy of sun? The answer is sun. Question number six says non green plants get their food through. The answer is from dead and decaying matter. Question number seven the process of photosynthesis takes place in answer is green plants only now in this b section what you have to do is you have to give short answers so the first question is what is needed by a leaf to make food the answer is the green pigment present in the leaves is called chlorophyll which traps the energy from sunlight. Thus, a leaf needs air, water, sunlight to make their own food. Okay? Question number two. How does dodder get its food? Answer is, dodder get its food from the food Prepared by other green plants. Unko kahan se milta hai food? Wo dusro, dusri green plants ke banai huye food pe depend karte hain. Question number 3. What is the function of stomata? Answer. Stomata help in the exchange of gases. Question number 4. From where do Non-green plants get their food. Answer. Non-green plants get their food from dead and decaying matter. In section C, you have to answer the following questions. Question number 1. How will you test the presence of starch in leaf? Starch ka presence leaf mein hai, ye kaise test karenge? So, the answer is, following are the steps to test the presence of starch in a leaf. Step number one, take a leaf of any healthy plant. Step number two, boil the leaf first in water and then in alcohol. First water mein boil karenge, then usko alcohol mein boil karenge. Uh, step number 3, wash it under cold water. Step number 4, take 
dip this leaf in a dish and put few drops of iodine on it. Step number four में क्या करेंगे? Few drops of iodine उस leaf के ऊपर डालेंगे. So now what will be the observation? The observation is the color of the leaf will change into blue black color. वो blue black color में change होगा. तो इससे में क्या पता चलता है? Conclusion. This shows that the food prepared by leaves during photosynthesis is in the form of starch. Okay? Question number two. How do plants use the food prepared by them? Answer. The food prepared by leaves is used to get energy and growth of the plant. उनको energy और plant के growth के लिए half use होती है. And the remaining food is stored in the form of starch in leaves, stem, roots or fruits. ठीक है? Question number three. How are Plants and animals interdependent. Plants और animals एक दूसरे पे निर्भर कैसे करते हैं? Both plants and animals are interdependent on each other. How? As the green plants are the main producers, main food producers, they also give out oxygen. Now, animal breathe in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide which is needed by plants for photosynthesis. Animals help plants in dispersing their seeds. So in this way plants and animals both are interdependent on each other. Okay. Question number four. Why is it important to maintain a balance between plants and animals in Na nature. It will be nature, okay? Not natural. It will be nature, okay? Answer. A balance between plants and animal is needed to maintain life on earth. Balance plants or animals mein kyun chahiye? To maintain balance of life on earth, okay? First point is, if the number of animals increases plants may not be able to supply enough food and oxygen agar animals ke numbers bar jate hain to plants khana provide nahi kar payega now if there is an increase in the number of plants the carbon dioxide supplied by animals may not be enough for plants to kya hoga agar plants ज़्यादा हो जाएंगे तो जितना कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड एनिमल प्रोड्यूस करती है उतना सभी प्लांट्स के लिए एडिक्वेट नहीं हो पाएगा ओके इन सेक्शन डी नेम एनी टू सो व्हाट यू हैव टू डू इन दिस यू हैव टू गिव टू एग्जांपल्स ऑफ ईच ए एडिबल रूट्स आंसर विल बी कैरेट एंड रेडिश सेकंड वन इज एडिबल स्टेम्स the answer will be sugarcane and potato. C. Edible leaves. Answer. Spinach and cabbage. D. Edible seeds. Answer. Almond and cashew. So students, this was all about chapter 1 which is the green plants, the producers of food. So stay, stay tuned for the next chapter. Thank you. So that's all about today's video. Do like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And yes, don't forget to hit the bell icon.